that there's a there's one person I interviewed in my research, a man named Lee Sullivan, who who uh, basically taught me several baselines. And one of them was actually called the Marshall. And I don't have absolute proof, but I believe that it's quite possibly one of the earliest boogie woogie bass figures. And I also think it's most likely that the earliest boogie woogie bass figures were four parts rather than eight parts. So instead of being one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, the Marshall bass figure is simply. something with that bass figure, just something slow to, uh, and then build complexity later on. So let's see what happens. Such a good percussionist that because it, I'm not stepping on his toes with the, with the pitches that might suddenly be out of alignment, um, I can get away with it. But that's one aspect of boogie woogie. 